Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this video, I want to introduce you to video page templates in SharePoint. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So look, when you, let's say, create a new page in SharePoint, you can add any web parts, right? You can add text, you can add quick links and so on. Uh, in case if you need to add some videos, uh, you know, you would usually choose the stream, you know, web part and essentially from that point on, uh, you know, choose the specific video you want to add. However, we actually have uh, a much quicker option if you are creating pages uh, and uh, want uh, videos embedded on those pages. Uh, let me show you when you create a new page and you probably have already seen those options instead of blank one. Um, you know, essentially all those templates that exist, they have a play button, uh, you know, layered on top. All right, so we have a few. Uh, let me choose this one, for example. Essentially, um, it's a page template that already contains uh, the stream web, web part, among other customizations. So look at this. It's truly a template with, uh, you know, all these different web parts already uh, populated for you. So um, pretty much here, all I have to do, because I already have images, I already have some of the widgets, you know, layout figured out for me. Look, the stream web part is already here. And all I have to do is just, you know, I guess, choose a specific video I want to maybe embed. And, you know, I'm pretty much done. All right, I can obviously customize and, um, you know, customize this page further maybe eliminate some stuff, uh, but, um, you know, here it is. And of course, um, because it's a stream web part, I can tweak it further if maybe I want to point to a folder of videos or embed a playlist or, you know, just uh, go after all the videos, I have a chance uh, to do so. So it pretty much helps. Um, yeah, and obviously you have to give it a title. So just like that, you know, in order for me to save it, just like that, and then let's publish it. Uh, now, what's actually interesting, and I think this might actually be a, even a better um, kind of a, a option or use case for you to utilize those uh, video page templates. Um, they're also available when you're trying to create a news post, all right? So when you try to create a news post, let's say you have a news widget, right? Trying to create a news post. Uh, the, because each and every now, uh, you know, news post, each and every announcement uh, is its own SharePoint page. Once again, you have uh, those templates available here. And because it's an, a news post, so let me show you. So once again, look, I can just, um, uh, uh, you know, give it a name. And of course I can embed the video uh, among, um, you know, other things. And because it's a news post, um, instead of just being published like a page, when I click post and send, it's posting it automatically to the uh, news uh, web part. And it also gives me a chance to uh, send an email. All right. So I can send it to my a distribution list. You know, maybe I can send it to a few individuals. And what's uh, once again cool about this option is that uh, it pretty much uh, embeds the entire, you know, newsletter. Uh, inside of, um, you know, uh, the entire post, I should say, inside of the uh, email. So uh, here we go. And, you know, even if I did not add the video, but if there was a video that I, you know, added, it would be essentially within uh, within that uh, email, you know, body of the email. And it's a very nice experience. So users can pretty much read and, you know, view everything from uh, the convenience of their, um, you know, Outlook uh, email client. So that's essentially the functionality. Again, you know, you can obviously, uh, you know, create your own pages, start from, uh, you know, uh, scratch and, you know, pretty much um, create brand new pages with whatever look and feel you have. But you do have some of this, you know, templates that already are available and um, all you need to do is just fill them out and, uh, and uh, you know, and essentially have them available uh, to the other users. All right, so that's all nice and quick uh, video today. So that's all I really wanted to show uh, to you in this video. Hopefully you learned something new and as always happy to see you on my YouTube channel. Goodbye.